Training film on electronic disbursement of NREGS wages to post offices. The National Rural Employment Guarantee Scheme commenced with effect from 2nd February 2006 in order to generate assured employment opportunities to the rural poor and to enhance the natural resource base and rural livelihood security. Initially, the scheme was launched in 200 backward districts in India, followed by 137 more districts from 1st April 2007 onwards, and the entire country since 1st April 2008. The main objective of NREGS is to provide at least 100 days of guaranteed wage employment in a financial year to each household in rural areas whose adult members volunteer to do unskilled manual work. The Department of Post entered into an MOU with the Government of Andhra Pradesh to disperse NREGS wages on time to the beneficiaries right in their own village through the Post Office Savings Bank accounts. In order to speed up the process of wage payments, ensure proper identification of wage seekers and improve monitoring of the various processes. Electronic disbursement of NREGS wages is being done on a pilot basis at Shet Palli and Polkampet branch post offices in Lingampet Mandal in Nizambad district. Besides easing the process of wage payments at post offices, the electronic disbursement process has proved a boon to the wage earners, as this has improved timely wage payments many fold. This pilot project is in partnership with the government of Andhra Pradesh and AP Online and covers over 500 post offices in the entire Nizamabad district. The process begins with the enrollment of wage seekers by taking their fingerprints on a biometric machine. Fingerprints of eight fingers, excepting the little fingers of both the hands, are taken for biometric authorization of wage payments. A deduplication process is also run to check double enrollment of wage seekers by impersonation, if any. Once this is done, the data of enrolled wage seekers is uploaded onto the POTD machines. The MPDO generates the wage payment orders electronically and uploads the same to the EGS server situated in Hyderabad. The project manager EGS uploads the wage payment order onto the AP Online server. AP Online then processes the wage payment order and makes it available to the head postmaster. The head postmaster approves transmission of pay orders to the SO and its VOs only to the extent of availability of funds from the state government in his office. He also arranges for supply of cash for disbursement of wages. The BO and the SO make wage payments to the wage earners. Point of transaction device, that is POTD, is the machine through which the disbursement of wages is effected electronically. The POTD has biometric reader, GPRS or mobile connectivity and a printer. The paying offices connect to the AP online server through GPRS connection available in the POTD machine and download the wage payment orders. The payments are made after biometric authorization. In order to receive the wages, the wage earners are required to go to the post office along with the NREGS savings bank passbook and wage slips issued by the MPDO. The branch or sub-postmaster enters the account number in the POTD machine and asks the wage seeker to put his finger impression on the biometric reader. On successful verification, 
the BPM or SPM enters the amount sought to be withdrawn by the wage seekers. He then takes a printout of the receipt of the transaction. One copy of the transaction is kept at the post office and the other copy is handed over to the wage earner along with the money after making entry in the passbook. At the end of the day, the BPM or the SPM takes out the printout of the consolidated report and account for the same in the post office accounts. Merits of the project Wage seekers get timely payment of wages earned. No need of withdrawal forms for taking payment of wages since filling up a withdrawal form is a hurdle as most of the wage seekers are illiterates. No wrong payments by impersonation. All bookkeeping work at post offices is reduced to the minimum level. Online management of cash flow and other management activities through portal. All MIS is available at the click of the button. As post offices are spread in all villages, including in the remotest corners in the country, this came as a boon to the daily wage earners who receive wages promptly through transparent method, avoiding any scope for corruption.